This is Jake Bailey who won the punting job. They drafted him. Ryan Allen, the longtime punter, no longer there. And his first punt is a beauty as a Patriot. Essentially like a Julian Edelman being able to work in the middle of the field, those change of direction kind of routes too. So he is going to fit in beautifully with a wide receiver core that played great tonight. On it. Jakeem Grant waiting for it. Well, there was contact there, and Grant had to walk away from it as the timing was thrown off. Grant was tripped, and the ball ended up at the eight-yard line, a 53-yard punt. Actually intern for Condoleezza Rice at one point during its collegiate years. Jakeem Grant waiting for it. Sprints over, hit immediately. The time that happened was 2013. They have two today. Returnable for Grant with a flag down. Grant is chopped down. Punter and deep back is Braxton Berrios. He's in camp with New England. Good hands. They're caught 12. Hands are going the first three times they had the ball. Berrios is back and fair caught at the 10. After a busy night doing Notre Dame in Georgia last night for CBS. Beautiful bun here by Jim Beal. He back Berrios in the last second signal of a fair catch drifting back to the seven. Jake Bailey with the punt. It looked like New England was making some moves again. And there he is waving for him. A lot of the third catch back at about the eight. Slater was down there covering. 42 yarder. Well, I remember interviewing you when you played for the Raiders. You were good in the and Here's the punt, which Berrios will let bounce him back to him. And Slater kept it alive. You know, you don't see that much, but that's why he's a seven time Pro Bowler. Now that was just terrific. What hustle by Matthew Slater. Great opportunity. Giants trying to ride a little momentum after the come from behind victory last week against Tampa Bay. Jake Bailey punting to Andre Roberts. Has a little room to work with from the 34. And the punt from Jake Bailey. No rush. Roberts backpedaling. Flagged down as he brings it into the 13. Alexander, the youngster, Milano, combining. Some pressure, but Jake Bailey handles it. Clean punt and a good one. Roberts back to the 34. Trying to circle to the outside. He does. Jake Bailey, who has quickly emerged as one of the best punters in the league. This is returnable, though, if he can catch it. Line drive. Roberts from the 19. Makes one man miss, and flags fly. Three of them. This is Trey Quinn. Fair catch called for and made at about the 12-yard line. Getting a chance to play. Had been in the league for a while, so. What a great offensive mind to play for, North Turner. This is Trey Quinn. Quinn hit hard as he. So Trey Quinn hoping for some room to return this. He's not going to get it. Has to make the fair catch backing up toward his own 10-yard line. 58-yard drive there. And Steven Sims Jr. will not run this one back as it rolls through the end zone. It's incomplete. Here is the punt. Golden Tate stays away, and that ball goes out of bounds. Billy well, drives this back to the eight-yard line where Barrios will field it and then is forced out. So Bailey looks for a pin here, and it settles in and out perfectly. Great pin punt by Jake Bailey, and that vaunted defense will be back out there. Oh, what a way to start. As Barrios feels this just beyond the 10. The mic. Oh. And then the fair, after all that, the fair catch. So he's number three all time against a single opponent with the work he has put in through the years against the Jets. That is muffed and it is jumped on. And then one and five right in their face right now. Oh. 
And of course, the punt <laughs> bounces at about the one inch line <sighs> for the Pats. Difficult for you to see the double team early. And Tom, for the first time, I mean, he doesn't get confused often, but he's going to throw to Edelman there. He's double teamed right at the end of it. And he doesn't have quite the same time he's had in some of the past years to get through the progressions. Jake Bailey, the rookie punter. That was a surprise to see. The fourth most punts in the league. Moved. It's Bailey with Hilliard back, backtracking, 30 yard line. Pauses for a moment, takes off. Anyway, it's fourth and 12. Okay. <laughs> I don't think so, but I'm also understanding sometimes. That's the fair catch by Hilliard, holds on. Using him as a weapon. Jake Bailey to do the punting. It's Justice Hill. And angling over says Cyrus Jones. Cyrus Jones takes him at the 18 yard line. Marcus Peters, you better be careful with him. He doesn't always do the predictable. Bailey's kick is a good one. And a fair catch is called for and fumbled by Jones. He plays out of you right now. Nose down with backspin. Jones is back there. And the ball takes a hop backwards and he's down at the six yard line and for a touchdown on that play short kick by Bailey 14 yard line Justice Hill and Hill running down the sideline but is out of bounds here's we've seen over the years with the Ravens and now really not now this team is built around its secondary and they are tremendous Jones will let this one go and it gets down to about the nine yard line with Bailey's first punt went for 39. Good hang time here. And beautifully placed by Bailey, the rookie from Stanford. Goes out of bounds at the five after a 55 yard boot, pinning the Eagles. They're, they're probably having a longer drive, obviously, and probably get points because it's a chunk play on that drive. Ooh, tough catch. Bounces at the five, and who else but Matthew Slater there to cover it up at about the three. Thank you. Let's try it. I'll one up you every time. Let's go. <laughs> oh, he's going to field it at the five. Take it to about the 11. Is he going to field this back at the five? He does. Bounces at the 20. And I'm going to start at the 35. An outstanding punt, and I can tell you, for the conditions of, I mean, he just got from the 34. It's called a 54-yard punt. And bring you in for that one. <laughs> a little pop-up kick. Pollard drops it, picks it up. Can't make it to the 20. Is effective today as he saved his best for last. This one checks up finally inside the 10 with Matthew Slater downfield to tap it for the Patriots. 34 yard punch for the Patriots and the Bears and the Jets. They were a good category to lead in at the 15 yard line. DeAndre Carter. Punt. Fair catch is called for and made at the 10 yard line. A fake. Goes down. Punt. And it'll be down inside the five yard line or just outside. It spins back with 15 seconds. So, you know, hey, I'll tell you, there you go. About one out of seven are recovered by the kicking team. Bailey puts it in play. Look at this. And it goes out of bounds. Brandon Bolden almost had it. Almost had it. He got a flag down as well. Ooh, baby. It basically clinched the game now for Houston. 
Perfect hop. Bolden could not secure it. He's used to, and I think they're going to have to come up with a way to run the football better, Jim, to help that offensive line. Hasn't been there early. Hardman off the punt from Bailey. Kick nearly blocked. He was able to get it away. Erickson fields it. Lost the football. A scramble for it. It was Matthew Slater who was downfield on the coverage. And now a pile. New England indicating they have it. And they do. Phillips is the deep man. And Phillips is going to take this one out of his own end zone. Phillips makes a big mistake. Cannot do this against this New England special teams unit. Justin Bethel with the tackle. Jake Bailey said, descended. Righty Hunter, which was always never the case here. There's room for Roberts from the 10. Andre Roberts, head of steam. Good return man to the sideline. Away from New England, Trevor Davis is deep. Fair catch called for and lost it. Still on the ground and looks like it's covered by Miami at about the 11 yard line. Tay Hayes. Trevor Davis deep. This ball bounces at the five and rolling toward the end zone. It was saved by the Patriots and it's going to be down at about the four. Matthew Slater, special teamer extraordinaire, made the play at the goal line. We'll be back. His own 20 yard line for the punt. And he'll field it at the 11. To the sideline. 